the Poor Temps Network Handicap Hurdle is next in. This is a two mile and one furlong 0 to 100. The top one is Dixie's Tomb for B. Fotheringham, Montparnasse Redwood for Martin Leader, Moving Guerre for Ryan Costello, All About Eve, Alex Cherry, and Needle Pin, Ryan Costello, L. Brockwell, B. Fotheringham, Terrible King, Thomas Rogers, Zone Zero for Graham Clutterbuck, Naked Twister, Craig Beckwith, Ringer Ring of Roses, Martin Leader, Modine, Alex Cherry, Animator Voice, Dan Hughes, Broadway, Rackham, Vinnie Gerard, and Solomade Fiction for Thomas Rogers. 14 runners in this then. And they're caught in in the rain again now and racing away towards the first with the aerial shot of them over that first flight of hurdles with Ringer Ringer Roses and a needle pin. Two front runners disputed in the early league being joined by a third front runner moving Guerre. So we're going to get some pace in this race as they make their way down towards the second of the nine. And could these front runners set it up for a closer? Well, it's moving Guerre, Ringer Ringer Roses and a needle pin are the leading three with Animator Voice back in fourth as they get over number three. And it looks like Ringer Ringer Roses has won the battle to lead. And as we've seen in recent weeks, that one likes to go off in front and then just stops. Like it's been shot, but they come past the stand. And down towards the third, as we see them from the aerial view there. And just a quick recap from the last race. There was no commentary on the last race because the video kept stuttering and so decided to abandon the commentary on that one as it would have been totally out of sync by the time it was put out to watch so that one was video only so it's anyways ring ring roses in the lead moving Guerre second the needle pin is third and animator voice is fourth then all about he was moved through into fifth with broadway rackham after that one then sodomite fiction and towards the back of the field elm brookwell is the back marker and in front of that one montparnasse redwood but they are going pretty quickly and these leaders have a tendency to come back to the pack so wouldn't tear your ticket up if you're on all of those back to at the moment and it's ring a ring of roses who is in the lead with moving guerre in second and a needle pin back in third animator voices fourth and all about eve is fifth as they take flight number four so they're all safely over again and the leader has a two length advantage ring a ring of roses oh. The Ryan Costello pair second and third, moving Guerre in the needle pin, then animator voice for Dan Hughes is fourth, Alex Cherry's all about Eve, he's back in fifth, and then he's got another one just behind that, Modine with Sodomade Fiction on its inside and Broadway Rackham on its outside, then we've got Naked Twister, then Terrible King and then Zone Zero and Dixie's Tune and then a little bit of a gap to Montparnasse Redwood as they take number five, and the one that's out of shot now just gone into shot is L Brockwell, but they're racing there down towards the final six first and over the sixth flight they go just three more to take then now mistake there was by Modine that might have put pay to that one's chances but Ringer Ringer Roses is still in the lead from Moving Guerre and the Needle Pin Animator Voice is still there then comes all about Eve Broadway Rackham is the one that's coming out of a pack nicely and they're coming through to make a challenge on the outside Sonomade Fiction and Terrible King trying to run on to so to Dixie's Tune but it's still Ringer Ringer Roses in front being scrubbed along by the pilot with a Needle Pin in second and Moving Guerre third Broadway Rackham on the outside is fourth and then Animator Voice going to try and get through the inside Sonomade Fiction's got nowhere to go at the moment in his box for room but it ring a ring a roses over the third last in front from all about Eve who's now moved through into second animator voice and Broadway Rackham then comes moving where a needle pins dropping away Sonomade Fiction has decided to pull round the outside but over the second last they go and it's still ring a ring a roses in front but Broadway Rackham is closing and he's now about to take it up it's Broadway Rackham who takes it up ring a ring a roses drops away as usual the animator voice is back in third over the final flight they go and it's Broadway Rackham who's racing there into the final furlong with a clear lead and he's being chased by Sonomade Fiction who was boxed in Broadway Rackham in, in the lead but Sonomade Fiction is eating up the ground but I think the post is going to come in time for the leader and Broadway Rackham is going to take it up towards the line Broadway Rackham Rackham wins it, Solomade Fiction is second, Animator Voice third, Ring of Ring of Roses on for fourth, then all about Eve was after that one, the field will trail back to L Brockwell, and it's a win for Vinnie Gerard. I think that might be his first jumps winner of the season, and Solomade Fiction was definitely unlucky because it was boxed in when it was ready to make its move and had to switch around the outside, whether it would have got to the leader or not, I don't know, but Broadway Rackham wins it for Vinnie Gerard. Sonomade Fiction for Thomas Rogers was second. Animator Voice for Dan Hughes third. Ring Ring of Roses for Martin Leland was fourth. And All About Eve for Alex Cherry was fifth.